Once upon a time in a quiet village, surrounded by tall mountains, there lived a young man named Marky. Marky was known for being smart, kind, and hardworking. People liked being around him because he had a natural charm. But there was one thing that held him back from earning the respect he deserved. It was a set of six habits that stopped him from growing and reaching his full potential. The first habit he struggled with was putting things off. Marky had a habit of delaying his tasks, always thinking he had plenty of time to do them. This led to missed chances and unfinished work. His friends and family often told him how talented he was, but they also worried about his habit of postponing things. Deep down, Marky knew that this habit was holding him back in life, but he couldn't find the willpower to change. One day, Marky came across an old wise teacher known for his wisdom. He decided to seek the teacher's guidance in the hope of overcoming his bad habits and earning the respect he yearned for. So, Marky journeyed to the top of a nearby mountain where the wise teacher lived in a simple temple. The wise teacher greeted Marky with a warm smile and invited him to sit beside him. Marky began sharing his struggles with putting things off and his desire to be respected by others. As he spoke, the wise teacher nodded in understanding. After hearing everything, the wise teacher spoke with a calm and comforting voice. Marky, my young friend, he said, respect isn't something you can find just lying around. It's something you have to earn. You must become someone others naturally look up to. To gain respect from others, you must first learn to respect yourself. And to do that, you must let go of the habits that are holding you back. Marky's eyes widened with anticipation as he listened closely to the wise teacher's words. He was eager to learn about the six habits and how to free himself from them. The first habit you need to leave behind is the habit of delaying things. When you put off your tasks, you miss chances to grow and achieve great things. Instead, embrace discipline and take care of your responsibilities. Pay attention to the present moment because it's the only time that truly matters. Marky nodded feeling a spark of hope inside him. He understood that the wise teacher's words held deep truth. If he could conquer his habit of procrastination, he'd be one step closer to earning the respect he longed for. The second habit you should let go of is self-doubt, the wise teacher continued. Marky, believe in yourself. You have the power and ability to do amazing things. Trust your skills and have faith in your journey. Always remember that every great achievement starts with a single step. Marky took a deep breath, soaking in the wise teacher's words like a spong. He knew that self-doubt often held him back, making him question his own abilities. But now, armed with the wisdom of the wise teacher, he felt a renewed sense of confidence and inner inspiration. The third habit you should leave behind is the habit of talking negatively about yourself, the wise teacher advised Marky. Your thoughts have the power to change your life and shape your reality. Be mindful of the words you say to yourself. Replace self-criticism with self-compassion. Encourage and uplift yourself just as you would a friend. Marky's heart swelled with gratitude for the teacher's guidance. He realized he had often been his own harshest critic, tearing himself down with harsh words and judgments. But now, he pledged to change and develop a more nurturing and positive mindset. The fourth habit to let go of is the fear of failure, the wise teacher continued. Failure is not something to be afraid of. It's an opportunity to learn and grow. Embrace it with an open heart. It's through failures that we discover our true strength and resilience. Marky felt a weight lift off his shoulders as he absorbed the teacher's words. He had always been afraid of failing, fearing the judgment and disappointment of others. But now, he realized that failure is merely a stepping stone on the path to success. After this, the wise teacher shared the fifth habit to avoid, the need for validation from others. True respect comes from within, Marky, the teacher said gently. Seek approval from yourself, not from others. When you live in alignment with your values and follow your own path, others will naturally respect and admire you. Marky felt a sense of liberation within himself. He had spent much of his life seeking validation from others, constantly comparing himself to those around him. But now he understood that his worth was not determined by others' opinions. He would forge his own path and find respect from within. 
The sixth and final habit you should leave behind is the need for control, the wise teacher concluded. Life is full of surprises, and you must embrace its ups and downs. Let go of trying to control every outcome and trust in the wisdom of the universe. Have faith in the journey and trust the process. Marky closed his eyes, savoring the teacher's final words. He felt a profound change within himself, as if a heavy weight had been lifted from his soul. He knew that the path to leaving these six bad habits behind wouldn't be easy, but he was determined to embark on it with unwavering resolve. Afterward, Marky thanked the teacher for sharing the valuable knowledge. He said with gratitude in his voice, Master, your wisdom has opened my eyes and set me on a path of self-discovery and growth. I will leave behind these six habits and build a life filled with discipline, self-belief, positivity, resilience, self-validation, and surrender. The teacher smiled. His eyes filled with inner joy, and he said to Marky, Remember, respect comes from living in alignment with your values and being the best version of yourself. May your journey be filled with joy and the respect you seek. And so Marky began his journey of transformation. With each passing day, he practiced leaving behind his old habits and replacing them with new ones that brought him closer to his true potential. Slowly but surely, he noticed a change in himself and in the way others saw him. As Marky's discipline grew, he became known for his unwavering commitment to his goals. People marveled at his ability to complete tasks efficiently and gracefully. His self-belief radiated confidence, inspiring those around him. The negative self-talk that once troubled him was replaced with words of encouragement and self-compassion, creating a ripple effect of positivity in his life. Marky embraced each failure as an opportunity to learn and grow. He saw setbacks as valuable lessons that propelled him forward on his path to success. As he embraced his own journey and sought validation only from within, Marky discovered a newfound sense of freedom and authenticity in life. Marky learned to accept life's uncertainties, releasing his need for control. He trusted in a bigger plan and found comfort in knowing that some things were beyond his control. He focused on accepting and embracing the present moment. As Marky transformed himself completely, the villagers noticed a change in him. Now people respected and admired him, not just for his intelligence and kindness, but also for his inner strength and wisdom. They saw a young man who had overcome all his bad habits and became the best version of himself. Marky's story spread far and wide, inspiring others to leave behind their own limiting habits and embark on a journey of self-discovery and growth. Marky's story became a source of hope and a reminder that true respect could be earned by anyone with the courage to let go of habits that held them back. From that day forward, Marky continued to inspire others with his unwavering commitment to growth and self-improvement. He became a mentor to those seeking guidance, sharing his wisdom and helping them overcome their own obstacles. Through his actions and words, Marky proved that everyone has the power to transform their lives and earn the respect of others. As he looked out at the village he once called home, he felt an overwhelming sense of gratitude. Gratitude for the wise teacher who had set him on this path gratitude for the lessons he had learned, and gratitude for the respect he had finally earned, not by seeking it, but by leaving behind the bad habits that had held him back for so long. I hope you enjoyed the story, and if you found this motivational tale inspiring, please consider subscribing to our Wisdom to Tell YouTube channel. See you in the next motivational story.